For April of 2022, we have an exciting new enhancement that is designed to take your revenue analysis to the next level. We've added some cool new metrics to the last year and forecast section within the day-by-day -day module. To check out the new feature, start by navigating to a hotel's day-by-day -day module. Once you have that module pulled up and your desired date range set, click on the last year and forecast tab up top to toggle to this other view. You'll notice that we've added lots of new metrics and variance columns, which now make this tab a one-stop shop for monitoring your performance versus same time last year pace, forecast, and your budget goals. Let's start by checking out the first set of columns that are unique to this tab. The last year and variance to last year column shows your last year total numbers. So for example, on this date last year, we sold this many rooms at this ADR, which gave us the following room revenue. By using the variance columns, you can see what is sometimes called reach to last year. So this hotel has a reach of this many rooms to match last year's performance and needs to make up this much in ADR and this much in revenue to match last year's performance. Next, Let's look at the same time last year and variance column. This is the section where you can examine how you are pacing versus same time last year. The same concept of reach applies here as well. And in this example, our hotel is beating last year pace by this many room nights, this much growth in ADR, and this amount in room revenue, but still has some room to grow here where they are pacing a little bit behind. Just a reminder, toggle between the same time last year and net same time last year to account for cancellations and no-shows. The second to last column here shows your budget and the corresponding reach to budget. Use this section to make sure that you are on target to hit your budget goals, and if you are not on target, to identify ways where you can implement a strategy change that should be implemented to improve your performance. Last, the forecast section compares your current on the books performance with your forecasted performance. Be sure to toggle between the spider forecast and your RMS forecast to get a total picture. Be sure to head to spider and try out this new functionality and let us know what you think. Thanks for watching.